Around this time tomorrow, President Barack Obama will be here to deliver a farewell address after eight years in office. A new documentary features many average Chicagoans who cross paths with the president on his political journey and reflect on the end of his presidency. CBS 2's Dorothy Tucker takes a look in this original report. We have the historic Chicago Sun-Times cover. Mr. President. <laughs> it tops the pile of newspapers and magazines uh, so Nikia Carpenter has been collecting the last eight uh, years. I think it is fair to say you are a huge Obama <laughs> fan. <laughs> huge. <laughs> it's a love affair that began in 2008 when Carpenter campaigned for Obama, a Chicago filmmaker. She is marking the end of his presidency with this. I'm young. A farewell documentary that features what she calls everyday Chicagoans. So these are not necessarily stories of people who have titles. Mm, no. Nope. And mm -mm. long no. public figures. No. And everyday people who have these amazing stories. Like Katie Murphy, who joined Obama's campaign after her two year old son died of heart failure. When President Obama, Senator Obama at the time, announced his candidacy for president, and made health care and science two of the initiatives that he was tackling, I said, I need to help this man win. Some of the documentary, like Murphy, worked on the campaign, or like Dr. Pat Blessman, helped with fundraising. But others served him pancakes, cut his hair, or attended a book signing and delivered a prophetic message. When I shook his hand and I said, Mr. President, it was a lock. All of them get a chance to say farewell to the president. God bless you. God bless your wife. While the president's farewell address may be tomorrow, the documentary plays at Harper Theater in Hyde Park on January 19th, Obama's last full day in office. Reporting live from the newsroom, Dorothy Tucker, CBS 2 News. Back to you, Rob. Yeah, really nice that they're just talking to average folks yeah. who were touched by him in some way, right? And they had a lot to say. Sure do. All right, Dorothy, thank you.